To what degree were the antebellum social reform movements the expression of a primarily Protestant American culture? Well, the Protestant, the, the, great awa the second great awakening, the religious revivals of the first part of the 19th century had a tremendous impact on the reform movements of that era. Out of the revivals came a, an impulse to improve society, to cleanse society of sin, the idea of what they call perfectionism, that both individual persons and society as a whole could have a new birth, really, and, and cleanse themselves of past sins and really uh, operate on a moral basis. Um, Roman Catholics, of whom there weren't that many at that time, but their numbers were increasing due to immigration from Ireland, uh, didn't hold to this view at all. They believed that sin was endemic in American in life, human life. Man was born in original sin. The best you could do was to ameliorate sin. You could assist the poor. You could make slavery less oppressive. But you couldn't talk about a society that cleansed itself of sin altogether. So there was this Protestant ethos in the reform movements, um, which was not surprising in an overwhelmingly Protestant country, which was going through these religious revivals at that very time. 